Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. We give all the glory to the mighty Jehovah. Beloved, let us pray. Heavenly Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, we thank you for another day like this, for your children around the whole world. Spirit of the living God, we thank you for taking care of us. It is by your power, by your might, and by your authority. This morning, you have given us a word. We thank you, and we want to hear the word as we are tested to hear the word of God. Spirit of God, speak through a clay. I am a filthy clay before you. Magnify yourself and let your word come forth. You alone give the utterance for your word. May your word be upon us this morning so that our test for your word will be seen in our hearts. We give you all the glory, Spirit of God. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Son. Thank you, Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name I pray. I take this opportunity to greet the viewers of Prophet Kanewu for availing yourself this morning to hear the word that the Holy Spirit has given to us. Thank you, God Almighty. In Jesus' name, amen. Beloved, Holy Spirit has given us a word. And the title of the word is the kingdom of God is at hand. And without wasting time, I read the Bible from Matthew 6, 33. Let's hear the word of God. But seek ye first the kingdom of God and its righteousness. And all these things shall be added unto you. Beloved, there are two kingdoms. The kingdom of God, which is Jehovah Jireh, and the kingdom of Satan. But this morning, we are going to speak about the kingdom of God. Hallelujah. That's why the scripture said, we have to seek first. We have to seek first the kingdom of God. The kingdom of God consists of the righteousness and the holiness of God. The kingdom of God is all about his creation. Through him and all, which is our Lord Jesus Christ. In him, everything was created for him. And he is all in all. Hallelujah. The kingdom of God consists the king which is our Lord Jesus Christ. And the nation and his government and his citizens. And we are the citizen of his kingdom. When you believe and accept Jesus Christ as your personal savior and do the things he want you to be, be doing, you become his child, hallelujah. The kingdom of God, we have to do his commandment that we should live righteous life for, his, for him, hallelujah. So we go to another scripture which tell us about the kingdom of God. Beloved, let us turn our Bible to Luke 4 and the verses 43 and read. But he said to them, I must preach the kingdom of God. 
to the other cities also, because for this purpose, I have been sent. This is by our Lord Jesus Christ. So beloved, you and I, what are we doing? Are we preaching about the kingdom? Or we are preaching about prosperity? We have to preach about the kingdom to win souls for our Lord Jesus Christ. He said, I must preach about the kingdom of God to the other cities, those who haven't heard the word, those who doesn't know our Lord Jesus Christ, they have to know about the kingdom. His kingdom is forever and forever. So the word of God must be preached in daily basis, wherever we go, wherever we are, we have to proclaim and preach about the word of God. He is telling us in the scripture, he preached the word to the other cities. So you and I, are we doing the commandment about the kingdom of God? Sooner and sooner, he is going to come. And no one can escape that I didn't hear about the word. Hallelujah. Our master, our Lord Jesus Christ, is the king. And we who have accepted him and doing the work of him in righteousness and holiness, we are the citizens. And this morning, I have a question. Are we all on this earth, are the children of our Lord Jesus Christ or the citizen for the kingdom of heaven? The answer is no, because some people has rejected salvation and they are serving other goals. And when you do that, you can not be in his kingdom. So it is you and I as a believer to preach the word, to witness the word about our God's kingdom. Hallelujah. I will sing a song to glorify our master, Jesus Christ. Unto the Lord be the glory. Great things our Lord has done. Unto the Lord oh be the glory. Oh, great things he has done. Hallelujah, great thing our Lord will do. Greater things our master will do. Unto the Lord, oh, be thy glory. Oh, great things he has done. Beloved, the kingdom of God is at hand. We have to repent from our wicked ways. The kingdom of God, you cannot enter if you are not righteous or holiness. Sin doesn't enter the kingdom of God. So this morning, you and I have to repent from our wicked ways. We do so many evil. So it is time the kingdom of God is at hand. Hallelujah. We need to repent. This is about repentance. If you want to be in the kingdom of God. He knows his children. So beloved, it is you and I, our access to repent from sin. Jesus is our king and we who have accepted him and being in the righteousness and winning souls for him, then we can be as a citizen, as a citizen 
in the kingdom. You cannot be a citizen while you don't know him. And you cannot. You have to accept him. You have to repent. You have to live a holy life. Then you can be a citizen of his kingdom. Soon and very soon he is coming. So where are you going to run to? Oh, Jesus, our God and our King, have mercy upon us. Our last scripture is taken from Matthew 3, and the verse is 2 to 3. And is and saying, repent, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. For this is who was spoken by the prophet Isaiah, saying, the voice of the one crying in the wilderness, prepare the way for the Lord, make his path straight. This is about John the Baptist, preaching about repentance. So beloved, when Jesus Christ says we have to repent, it is a must. He, 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 is the, he is the one who knows you, the one who knows me. We need to repent and do whatever he wants us to do. He hates sin. And we live in sin. That's why this morning, the scripture is telling us in Matthew 6, 33, it says, seek he first. He alone should be the center of our life. Spirit of the living God, we thank you for your message. We thank you. And please help us so that we run for, from our wicked ways and do the right thing for our master Jesus. We give God the glory. We give the son the glory. We give the father the glory. Spirit of God, we give you all the glory that you have let us know about this message. We read it every day. But Lord, Jesus, Holy Spirit, help us so that we will repent from our wicked hearts. May your will shall be done over our lives. Father, we thank you. Son, we thank you. Spirit of God, we thank you for your message. I take this opportunity that God Almighty, Jehovah Jireh, you will bless your servant and protect him to win souls for your kingdom and also the family. Lord, the viewers or the listeners, may you bless them and also their heart desire will be met by you almighty God. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus, your mighty name, everything will be settled. Amen and amen.